Brandon Ayuk is going to be the leading receiver for the 49ers in 2023. This time we're going to start with Pete. I think uh, I'm buying this because he was our top wide receiver last year. So why, I don't know why it would change. And uh, I think that we're going to get – I'm a big Trey Lance fan, and I think that he's going to get a chance to show what he can what he can do. I don't care who's really starting at quarterback. I think that Brandon Ayuk is just the best – wide receiver that we have like uh, on this team. So I'm going to, I'm going to buy that. Yeah. I hear you, Pete, but I'm selling it. Okay, <laughs> I'm looking at Debo Samuel, man. How explosive was Debo Samuel, you know, in what 2021 mm-hmm. or 2022 rather last year, we know it was a, it was a disappointing season. He was banged up. Sorry. Pardon me. I, that's Brandon calling me right now. He's saying, I just heard you talk about Debo now. Brandon's not happy about it. But I'm saying, looking what? At Debo. I'm looking at Debo. I want a Debo resurgence. I just know this guy. We see how explosive he is. He had the 1,400 yards. That's what got him paid. And I think he's going to get back to that standard. It's probably going to be close. It's going to be close between the two because they're both really good and talented. But I'm going back to Debo. Man. I love that, man. I Well... I'm going to go with a buy on this one. First of all, he's got a tremendous first name. Okay. I think we can all agree that brand brand is always good, but he is the best, one of the best route runners, not just on the 49ers, but in the entire league, in my opinion, I think he is really explosive. And I think the way, what we saw from him last year, I think it's just the tip of the iceberg and what he's going to bring in year four to this offense. We've seen, it doesn't matter who's the quarterback, right? To your point, Pete, doesn't matter if it's Lance, doesn't matter if it's Purdy. He's been a big target over the middle and gets that yak. And I really like him as our top target going into 2023. So we got we got two guys who, who are, are buying it and we got one seller, correct? That's yep. what we got. All right. Well, it's going to be a split one on this one because I'm selling this one. I think Ayuk is not mm. going to be the leading receiver for the Friars. I go with Baller on this one. I think it's going to be time for Debo to step back up. You know, Debo Samuel missed part of training camp last year, just wasn't fully healthy. Plus, the other thing with Debo Samuel last year, I think part of the reason his numbers were down was the way they were utilizing him. We didn't see him going over the middle as much as we had, you know, in in years past. We didn't see him being utilized on those over routes, on those crossers and those types of things where he's able to catch and run. It was a lot more screens, really short things where it was all about yak with him. Uh, The few times that they did get him the ball down the field, he looked like the old uh, Debo Samuel. So, uh, I'm going to say it's going to be Debo as the leading receiver for the 49ers in 2023, beating out Brandon Ayuk, who, I don't know, some people are thinking he might not even be a, a happy camper right now because of uh, some tweets and comments that he's been making out there. I just I'll tell you I... what, if Debo's the leading receiver, that's going to be a phenomenal year that the 49ers offense is yeah, going to have with sure. all the weapons that are out there, for sure. 